This way to Bear Country, you'll know when you're there. As soon as you enter, you'll feel like a bear. <laughs> I'm Jan Berenstain, half of the original creative team of the Berenstain Bears. My husband Stan and I created it in the early 60s. I'm Mike Berenstain. I'm the son of Stan and Jan Berenstain. The first books were created when I was 10 years old, but then later I became an illustrator and author and I joined with my parents in creating new Berenstain Bear books about 20 years ago. We had been turned down by other publishers because we did cartoons. We said our children like cartoons. And I remember one publisher telling us, but children like a lot of things that aren't good for them. When Ted Geisel became president of Beginner Books at Random House, we said, he's a cartoonist. Let's submit a book to him. And the first story you did, although it was about bears, it was not what was eventually published. The first story. No, it was a family story about a small bear who had been writing on the walls. Ted liked the idea, and he liked the characters and the drawings. His wife was sitting in, and she said, she said, that, that part where he goes hunt, hunt for honey, that would make a good book. And so that, that's when we went home and uh, did the honey hunt story. We ate our honey. We ate a lot. There is no more honey in our honey pot. My impression of Ted Geisel was that he was charming. He was helpful. Stan and I always thought that he was harder on us than he was on himself, because when he got stuck for a rhyme, he just made up a word. 